Today we test some really weird pet products. Let's talk about that. Good mythical morning. Pets are the friends that never disappoint. Nobody ever said, you know, today Waggy Gyllenhaal really hurt my feelings because they love you unconditionally and they deserve the same from us. We ask you how you spoil your pets because they deserve it and you answered. Luke said, biscuits. Dogs deserve real biscuits like Southern style. Mama used to make them that way biscuits. Mm. Mm. Wow. Human food for animals, okay. Yeah, Jordan said, we built a catio so my cat could enjoy being outside in the summer. Oh, a catio. Real nice. Okay, now baking and building are great, but today we are gonna highlight some pre-made, ready to use, super cool products that you can spoil your Bark Simpson or your Andrew Garfield with. It's time for Weird Products You Must Have Pets Edition. Okay, warning. We have animals in the studio today. It's like a zoo Plural. around here. So hold on to your collars. Or like a petting zoo, or a zoo if it just had like household pets. No, really just like someone's house that has multiple pets. And the first product we have is cat wine. When you don't wanna drink alone and your cat's the only person you know. Yes, <laughs> this is something that exists in uh, several different flavors. Uh, we have Moscato. Uh-huh. Just gonna pour it out here. Now, this is not actual wine. It's beet juice with catnip in it, which uh, I didn't really know what catnip was, but it's actually like a natural like plant that apparently cats love and makes them go crazy. Cat Bernay, which, oh, that's definitely beet juice. Look at that, Look. super, super pink. And then I've got some Pinot Meow. And I'm gonna, I'm gonna toss in this one here. Uh, yeah, this is available for $11.95 for each one of these bottles at apollopeak.com. Uh, not a sponsor, just letting you know if you want to get your cat drunk, you, you know where to go. Well, let's just, let's see what happens. Um, of course, we need a real cat for that. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome Vivian the cat uh, to Good Mythical Morning. Uh, this is Lizzie's owner. Uh, she's clearly in charge. Hey, Vivian, come, let's just see if she just is interested in, in the wine. She's a, she's a, she's a black cat. Should it's, I, it's, I, let me, I'm gonna put the wine out here, so you can bring the cat can turn up around behind the wine so we can see her drink it. Look at this, we've got, we've. Don't distract her. No, do, go up, go, do what you were about to do. do oh, <laughs> uh, 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 uh. Buddy. Oh, yeah. Buddy. Careful, Link, careful now. What do you mean careful? She's the one about to jump off the desk. Good cat. Good cat. Okay, Lizzie, what do we okay. do? We just stick her face in it? You look nervous. Is second. everything all right with you, cat? I, wouldn't, I mean, the one thing I told you to do was not hold her, so. I mean, <laughs> but I love her so much. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Vivian, it's wine. I Whoever know. turned it down. Aren't you thirsty for wine, cat? Yeah, it's got cat in it. Lizzie's been feeding you too much wine already. No, Time she doesn't the... drink. I mean, you can't, you can't get mad. <laughs> She's you abstaining. Too mad at no, her. Let's just give her another I second. I think if you're quiet, maybe let's just wait. Let's let her drink in peace. This is a very high class party, Vivian. There's light piano music playing in the background. And the one thing that we can add to this to make it a great experience for you is wine. Wine. Hey. We brought three kinds of wine. We have three wines. They're behind you. You're not looking at them currently. Right there in the bowl where you usually drink. Now, did Buddy. you? I think we, test, we tested this wine out at home with the cat, yes. right? Yes. And she did drink it at home? Yes. She's just a little nervous, a little stage fright. It's okay. I don't, you know, I don't like to drink in front of people either. Oh. She had lay down in it, girl. <laughs> I like to drink no. alone in my bedroom. <laughs> now, Lizzie, when she- In the closet. Put it on your phone. I don't know right? what kind of message we're sending right yeah. now. Yeah, okay. <laughs> she did like it, I promise. And she drank a lot of it? When you, Ooh, when yeah, your she drank a whole bowl. Drink, she drank a whole bowl, and then what happened? Presenting them with three options. Um, I mean, did she start to fe feline a little tipsy? Yeah. She Was she like it. stumbling everywhere? No, they kind of just flop around. Flop around? Yeah. She deposited a lot of hair into the uh, <laughs> Yeah, she's the cat shooting her. It's like a defense me mechanism at this point. <laughs> okay. Buddy, I well, think somebody's got to drink it. I think it's going to have to be you guys. Not with all that hair in it. You can drink right from the bottle, Link. I have my own bottle. You can drink from that one. Okay. <clears throat> all right, let, well, let's at least, let's see if it'll make us wallow around on the ground. Is it safe for consumption? For human consumption? That I don't know. I mean, if it can't kill a cat, it can't kill a person, right? That's science. Hmm. It tastes very beet juicy. That nippy nip. Oh, she's looking at me. Yeah. 
I'm drinking you, your wine. You know what the problem is? Uh, we need some we need some bread and some cheese to go with our wine. Oh, oh, and there, there she, she goes. goes. All right. Um, so with our cat Bernie, we've got some Catmambert cheese shaped mm. like a cat, as you can see. I know why she didn't drink it. And we've got some focaccia bread here. Let's see if that adds Let's see what's happening. To this. I've also so, got Moscato. Oh, here yes. she is again. She's back for the party. Oh, she wants some she of this bread. She does like cheese, so you might want to keep an eye on that. Oh, okay. Just a little. I don't have anything to. We're like animals at this point. Yeah. Well, <laughs> no, you know, you, you, no utensils. We're all in this together. So we got some mm, cat bread, cat cheese. Vivian, you could be living the life right cat now. Cat lime. What a missed opportunity. <laughs> Still not great. You're a star. The bread and the cheese is really good, though. The bread and cheese is really good. <laughs> Mm. Oh no. Okay. Yes, Lizzie keeps her cat on a leash. <laughs> I'm told that it makes cats wallow around, but not any more than regular catnip does. That's the that's the ruling, but no proof here. I wouldn't say get this if you're just as a person gonna drink it. Um, but maybe your cat will actually enjoy it. Next up we have the Twinkle Tush, covering your pet's barrel hole while simultaneously drawing an insane amount of attention to it. Available for $5.99 at TwinkleTush. Dot com. Oh yeah. Okay, so we have get ready. We have our dogs here, uh, Jade and there's Barbara in baby position. Say but, hi, everybody. But the position that hi. I don't love is um, is the one where she's walking away from me and she's giving me yeah. full well, full hole. And Barbara is like, pretty much always cool. exposing your butthole to me. Oh my gosh. Uh, you, so look, look at that, look at that. I mean, that's just, it's like the eye of Sauron back there. <laughs> it's, it's always like, looking at yeah, you. Yeah, man, it's like it tracks you down wherever you're at in the house. Jade only shows me hers when she's pooping or when she's really happy. Like, when she's happy, her tail will come up, but even these, this right here kind of obstructs it, which is nice. But for those uh, mere glimpses of genius, uh, you, you, you wanna have one of these. Now, these, oh. are, these are four cats, but we're gonna try them on our dogs because we don't have cats. You're gonna love it, Barbara. Don't worry. Just you just trust trust Daddy. Now with so much hair oh, on gosh. The, how are we gonna even get this oh, on no, here? There's just so much. Barbara, stay with me, baby. Stay with me. Stay with me. There we go. Yeah, there we go. Ooh, this is gonna be tight. No, 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 baby. No, baby. It's jewelry. I'm giving you jewelry, baby. I'm. I'm. It's okay. It's okay. Ow! Ow! She bit you. <laughs> She's trying to bite the thing off. Okay, hold on. It's, okay. I think I got. I Chase, could you come on there. hold the top of Barbara? Oh, this is getting intimate. <laughs> oh yeah. She has so it. much hair. Good job, Jane. Look at that. I got mine on there, right over the barrel hole. That is a surprise waiting to happen. I can't. She's, she, just, she's just walking around. She's got. She's got too much hair. This might need to be a three-man thing. I got to get this thing super big like this. Look at how Jade is totally frozen. She's like, when I hold her tail like this, she's like, doesn't move at all. In sharp contrast to another dog that I know and love, Barbara. Oh, there we go, right? Yeah, but it just. There's, there we go. Up oh, and just turn it. <laughs> this is. There the we go. There we go, baby. Look how beautiful it is. It's so beautiful. Oh, it needs to be swiveled a little bit. Let me just, oh God. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that. Show everybody, show everybody, Barbie. Look at that. Hold the tail up, right? That's perfect right there, look at that. Boy, it's so pretty. If that ain't a thumbnail, I've never seen one. <laughs> <laughs> they're like princesses. <laughs> yes, they're like the princesses yeah. now. Now, my question is, I, you I, have can, questions? <laughs> I can see why it's better for a cat because they walk around with their tail up all the time, but I'm just wondering, I mean, what's the poop situation? Is it like one of those trash cans at a fast food restaurant where you like, you know, gotta? Yeah, I think it just the opposite. I think it just pushes itself right out of the way. I don't know. I think I think this is pretty great. Um, you can get them for dogs, but not at TwinkleTush.com. There she goes. Uh, well, you know what? This looked like so much fun uh, when the dogs were experiencing she can stay here. it. Yeah, Barbara will not stay here. Uh, we were like, well, how how do we get in on this kind of fun? So we have created our own product. Uh, let's, let's show them, Link. It's the Twinkle Tush, the human Twinkle Tush. There it is. Of course, she's gonna smell it because that's what she does. It, it's kind of like a bedazzled bedonka donk. I got it now. Just so you know, this is not the actual butt. That is not the actual butt. It's actually on top of the jeans. I know it. I know you probably figured that we had that kind that that kind of protrusion. 
And Check it out, Jay. These are actually available for purchase because I know that you want one. Now we tried to get, uh, of course, Twinkle Tush is already taken because that's what that's called. We looked up Twinkle Butt. Believe it or not, Twinkle Butt is some DIY electronic vehicles company, not making it up. Then we looked up TwinkleHiney.com, and that's just a picture of Micah giving thumbs up. So we ended up going with SparkleBum.com. Go to SparkleBum.com right now to get your very own Badonkadonk. 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 You're gonna love it. And now moving on to the Bubbletastic Bacon Bubble Machine for dogs, because dogs love bubbles and all living creatures love bacon. All right, here we have the bubble making device which runs $24.95 on Amazon and it comes mm. with your bacon scented bubbles, which we can, uh, it smells uh, like- Pretty authentic. Like liquid, bacon bits. liquid smoke. We're gonna test this out on Superdog Enzo, who doesn't seem too excited yet. <laughs> but we have been told that Enzo goes crazy for bubbles, uh, but Enzo's an old boy, uh, as you might know, and he he's losing his sight, so we may have to direct him to the bubbles, but once he realizes that bubbles are happening, <laughs> he we should have attack. high expectations for this. Okay, I'm gonna turn this thing on here. Ready and on. Hey, Enzo. Enzo. Bubbles. Look. Bubbles, bubbles, Enzo. Bubbles. 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 There you go. Bubbles. Wake up. Hey there. Yeah, 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 yeah. You get them bubbles. You get them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah, look at him. Look, look, yeah, yeah, there's a bunch over here. Come around this way. Come here. It's good. We got him over here. We got him on the side. Come here. All right. Put him over here. Oh, yeah. There we go. Go, get boy. Him. Look at him, bubbles, boy. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> He's loving it, and he doesn't even taste them yet. I think he does. <laughs> look at that. He loves bacon flavor. They should have other flavors too. You know, they could have vomit. They could have other dogs' butts, dogs' own genitals. Your great aunt's crotch. Yeah, the, all that would be very good. I mean, he might be going even crazier. Look at him. Look at that. He thinks he's getting bacon with every bite. Look at this. Listen to the sound his teeth are making. It's so great. Now, anytime we have a bacon product on this show, you know that's an opportunity to make a BLT. So, Link, so we can get in on this action and make a bacon bubble lettuce and tomato sandwich. I have your side of the sandwich there. And just, just grab some bubbles. Just grab, <laughs> just, sorry Enzo. Um, okay. You smell the bacon in this? Oh, I'm, I'm, I'm getting very excited. Okay, I, that's, that's plenty. Okay. Whoops, I dropped my tomato. <laughs> does, does Enzo eat tomato? We'll find out. Me neither. <laughs> hmm. It work, totally works. <laughs> that totally has a bacon taste to it. Really? <laughs> you can't taste it. <laughs> Do the Enzo, man. You gotta, you gotta talk. <laughs> Enzo's very defeated now. He's like, you, you humans have taken all my bacon bubbles. <laughs> you want a sandwich? <laughs> <laughs> all right. If any of this was compelling, uh, get one for your dog. Thank you for liking, commenting, and subscribing. Enzo, say you know what time it is. Hi, my name's Angelica Cannon. This is my mythical beast, Willow. We're from Alpena, Michigan, and it's time to spin the wheel of mythicality. If you haven't heard, we have a YouTube channel called This Is Mythical. You can go over there right now and watch and listen to Ear Biscuits. Mike and Alex have their own show over there, and there's other mythical content. Go check it out. This is Mythical, and click through to Good Mythical More. We're gonna test out this dog translator on our dogs. See what they're thinking by how they're barking. Take and make. We want you guys to take a still from this episode and make us party, purdy. <laughs> party, <laughs> purdy. You can put us at a party. Make us purdy. Give us celebrity eyeballs. Put a celebrity's eyes onto our eyes. And then post that with hashtag take and make. Oh, who do I want to be? Click on the left to watch our show after the show, Good Mythical More. Click on the right to watch another episode of Good Mythical Morning. And make sure to check out our new channel, This Is Mythical, by clicking the video at the bottom. Thanks for being your mythical best.